All right, guys, welcome back. This is Bad Sense. So last time we um, tried and failed to get an anvil in 20 minutes on Extreme Survival. Let's see what the future holds for us. Well, hold on. The anvil appointments, yeah, it was. So we got to make a new challenge, actually. Oh, um, I forgot to do that. I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, so we have made the new challenge, and let's spawn the slimes in. Oh, dear. Yep, we must act quickly. If this is to work, there we go. We got the red slime slot going. And we're going to find enough slimes in here. Sounds like enough to make it. Alright, let's see where they're going to be. Let's see the first little bird's eye view right here. I think that one is the most. That we have, I guess, is the most. Next, number four. Alright, let's go to number four challenge. Build a nether portal in 20 minutes. All right, so for that you're gonna need a, both a water and a lava bucket. You're gonna need iron as well. So I think it's gonna be a challenge, but I think we can do it. If we can find a water and lava lake, then we'll be So, see you guys in the world. Just a few format changes I thought I'd tell you about. So obviously, as you can see, if you look closely, my heart's looking. Because I'm in hardcore mode. In hardcore mode, you die. If, well, you, if you're if you die, then it's over. So basically, I have to do. Not only do I have to get the Nether portal without any with in 20 minutes, dying as well, which will probably be a big challenge. Anyway, like all challenges, we need to get the stone tools first. That's all you need to do. Just get those stone tools like it's no big deal. Now just another... I want to say something. Today is my first day of school, actually. So, I will tell you about what you can expect from my channel in the um, few months where I'm going to have school. Well, usually a lot of the time I have a school. Basically, you can expect, of course, MHC. You can also expect one extreme survival video a week. However, if I'm not doing MHC, that's going to be up to three videos of extreme survival a week because I don't have any MH MHC to do. So usually I'll put up my um, extreme survival videos on Wednesdays, but on weeks when there's no MHC, I'll put them up Monday, Wednesday, and and. I also am going to do the occasional Minecraft map, and I'm going to okay, use some stuff on my survival world. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll like release a map or something. I'm also thinking about doing some other games. There is one game I play called Hearthstone. However, for some reason, I keep bugging out and I can't get it. You will be asked to actually record it. So once I figure that out, you can be, expect to see some Hearthstone videos coming out. And then especially, I forget what the date is, but there's this game coming out I'm really excited for called Star Wars Battlefront 2. And you can expect a few videos on that as well in the coming months. And so, that's going on with the channel. And I hope this is going to be a great year for the channel and for me as well. So, anyway, let's now make all our stone tools. Enough of that spiel. Alright, there we go. Wait, why isn't there a shovel? Isn't that the recipe for a shovel? Let's try it again. There we go, we got ourselves a shovel. Oh wait, what, what happened there? I made two shovels. That's just ducky. All right, let's make a furnace, and we need to get one more stone to make us. Because for some reason, I made two shovels on accident. And the bag's kind of getting onto me right now, and that's not good. All right then. Hey, um, let's make our way up onto the cloud. Actually, I'm gonna turn clouds off to increase our visibility. Video setting clouds. Off. 
So hopefully we can see a little bit more then. And I'm looking for lava because that's what we need. That's what we really need. Lava lakes. I mean, I see some lava springs. Of course, lava is very good. Was that flowing lava down there? Or was that lava lava? Hmm. I don't know what it is down yet. It does look like it, it is flowing lava, unfortunately. We need one of those good lava lakes. Let's actually go over there. We're going to start making our way over. That's because that's where we have a water we can get really high into the sky with it. And hopefully we can get some iron. And we can look for lava lakes. Pretty good. Here we go. A 31 dirt, that should be enough to go across right here. Do a little crossing. All right, now there's a lot of black bags, so I, I don't, doesn't like out and I just fall down into the cavern right, or the canyon right there. Um, all right, here we are. We've bridged across. Let's go up this, which one should we go up? I feel like this one would put us in a better position when we go up. All right, let's go up. Reaching new heights. Now I just realized I forgot to set a timer. Now while there is a timer at the bottom of the screen, because like of how the video is edited, I can't actually see that timer. So I'll just have to go off of what day it is. Cause like in the F3 menu, it tells you what day it is in Minecraft. Like day zero, it starts on day zero and then it can go to day one and day two. And each day is a minute. So when day one happens and I still haven't gotten the nether portal, I know that I fail the challenge. So let's hope that I don't need to do that, but yeah. Let's just get to building this nether portal. Alright, here we are. Stone. Maybe I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. There we go. Alright, we're up. Oh, we got iron right here. That's good. Just iron is hitting us right in the face. We need a total of seven. Two for the bucket. Well, I guess we don't really need buckets. Maybe we need four iron total. One for the buckets used to transport everything, and one for the flint and steel. Total. All right, that's gonna be enough iron. Now let's see where we can find ourselves some lava, a very useful commodity we're gonna need. Anyway, we also need coal, I'm quickly realizing. So let's go find coal. Coal, where you are. Alright, there's coal down there, but do I really want to take all the time to go down that waterfall and back up? I don't think so. There's coal right there. Perfect. Perfect, though. There we go. We got ourselves some coal right And we can use it. So, all the iron. Oh, there's some right there. We got coal. Yay, there we go. Yeah, I think that should be enough. Let's smelt it down. Oh, it's like my little alcove. <laughs> I guess you could call it an, al an alcove. Anyway, there is like a huge bed of water down there. Lots of lava. Areas where you can get lots of lava. And that's obviously a very good thing because lava is very important in this game mode. Trying to get another portal. You know, the port what if some of you guys don't know what I'm thinking of doing. Obviously like try to get a diamond pickaxe do the whole nine yards to build a proper proper nether portal. So I'm gonna be doing something called a poor man's nether portal. Basically I put lava and water in the correct position so it can create another portal. If you guys don't don't understand what I'm saying you'll just see in a bit. All right, so now what's an optimal place to put our um, nether portal? Another portal frame, rather. Probably down there somewhere. 
Oh, I forgot. I forgot to get the water. Oh, God. Well, there's a lot of other water. We can just get it. So we need a total of 10 waters. Oh, there's water over there. We need a total of 10 water in order to do all the stuff that we want to do. To get the nether portal. Alright, come on, come on. There's some water right there. You gotta move rather quickly. Flint it, okay. You need to get flint, okay? Get flint, alright. We need flint for that flint and steel. Where was the water I saw? Where's water? There's water. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Just doing this weird thing to get water down there. Alright, good. Now we're almost thinking it's easier to just build it down there anyway, because we're gonna have to do like boats and stuff. Get to lava springs. So yeah, let's do that. In real life I wouldn't have survived that, but okay, whatever. I see lava there, lava there. So I think I'm feeling kind of good about this. I'm feeling good that this will be the episode that we actually um, do something in. Alright, where should be a good place to put the nether portal frame? Alright, one, two. I'm digging to the mountain right here. Right, so you need two there. One, two, three there, then. You gotta go one, two, three, four, five, and one more up. You know, water is covering that whole area. So now we need to build a boat to get around to all these lava springs. We'll shut down this tree right here. Alright, good. We're not experiencing any more block lag that was very detrimental early on to our progress, but not anymore. Alright. Here we go. Oh, dang it. Good. All right, and then we have a so it was a boat. So let's go to that first lava spring I see. What's that? That's weird. Forever alone block. All right, there's our first lava. Spring. Alright, let's exit. How do you exit? Shift. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh well. Alright. Let's dig our way up. Source. Maybe I have a chance of winning. I don't know. Alright. Oh yeah, this is actually a good idea. Let's just have this here and build up. probably mark it that another portal frames here because I'm probably gonna get lost among the um mountains this deep mountain range I'm already lost oh yeah it was over here that way. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay so when we get past those two blocks right there those are right here Oh, that's where we cut down the tree. It must have been right here. Oh, yeah, here it was. There's another portal frame. All right. Here we can put our green block in there. All right. All right, we have one spare coal. Let's put a torch on this large beacon right here. You can see it over this mountain right here. All right, that's good. A nice little 
Peter right there. Surely we won't miss that. Where's my boat? Hmm, we can just make more, I guess. All right, let's head to the next spring. There we go. In fact, I'm actually kind of glad that it's getting night. You think about see a lot where the lava is going to be. Is that a skeleton? Or no, it's a zombie. I think it's only a zombie. Shift exit. Alright. Let's get in and out of here quickly. Alright, there we go. Alright. Let's see our beacon. But perhaps I want to do more iron. I think if we do two buckets at a time, then we can do it in a more timely fashion. All right, here we go. Into here. We don't have enough iron. We do have enough iron, actually. Let's make another furnace. Now let's areas we can go to next. Take the flint and steel wall. Oh yeah, that's the flint and steel. I guess we don't have enough for another bucket. Oh well. All right. Here we go. Let's hop in. Thought I saw more light this way. Yep, there's another one. For some reason my block burn block burn when I need them the most. It really stinks. Right. Is there lava down? Is there lava down here? Cool. Alright. I hope we're on fire. That's fine. This bad senator's on fire. Our beacon. Alright. I don't know like how much time we have right now, but I think we're making good time. Personally. Shift. Alright, there we go. Alright, there we go. Uh oh, we got some water pouring out into there. Oh, I do Alright, there we go. Hey, what happened? I don't want to be smelt. Right in the media. Alright, let's pick it up and place it somewhere again. Alright. There we go. Alright. I saw more light over here. That's good. I think if we just like go up there then dig across here, that'd be a little quicker. Swim up this waterfall. I'm not sure how that's possible, but it is apparently because Minecraft physics or whatever. Alright. Going up. I see the moon. It's about halfway up. And that means we have around five minutes to get seven things of water. Personally, I don't know if we can do it. Gotta try. Went up towards that fourth um, lava area. We see lava in there, actually. Wait, is that a lava? Please tell me that's a lava lake. Well, if it's not a lava lake, we'll just get this lava just in case. And if it is, then we have lucked out, probably. Alright, get that. Right there. Alright. Here we go. 
All right, now we definitely gotta check out that area because that may very well be a lake. If it is a lake, then I'm gonna break out in Happy Dance or something. Because we probably wouldn't have been able to win without a lake. We lost our boat, so I guess we're swimming back. All right, let's check up here. Peace be lake, peace be lake. Looking, is it looking good? Nope, not a lake. Well, I mean, it's another spring, which is pretty good. Let's make one more. Boat. I don't know where my other boat went. And there's a creeper. Can't get up, I guess. So, take the boat. Here we go. Do I still have a boat? Oh. Alright, we're like taking some damage. Alright, let's take the boat out. There we go. Now I have two more springs I can go to. One over there and the one over there. Shift. Oh, dang it. There we go. I'm probably be moving a little bit faster. I'd like to be moving faster anyway. Oh. oh no! Oh. Not this again. Alright. Break the boat. Cover the cavern. Alright. Once we do this, our nether portal is going to be half complete. Big creeper explosion over here. That's a thing. Alright. Here we go. There we go. Lava. Took more damage. But the price. Price you gotta. Yep, okay, there's our. Peek in there. Mm. Yeah, I'm starting to see creepers and stuff spawning on our establishment. Oh, there's a zombie actually. Let's try to... Alright, here we go. Let's place that correctly. Yeah, that was placed correctly, okay? Uh-oh, it is getting daytime. So I'm deeply afraid that we probably won't complete this task. So far, if we are not gonna win, I'm probably not looking like, not looking good that we're gonna win. So far, my KD, I guess, in terms of how many of these challenges I've actually won and how many I haven't won, it's really zero, and I played three. So, obviously, not a very good. Like I thought I, I thought getting another portal in 20 minutes would be realistic. Who knows? Maybe this, maybe this is the time. I'm playing in because it's like you have to navigate these crazy like this and it's certainly not very easy yeah so maybe once I switch to another world setting it's gonna become a lot better to do the challenges maybe I'm just getting bad luck you don't know so it does seem like I'm probably headed towards the beat here is it day one yet Oh, it is day one, and my timer's probably already run out by now, so... Unfortunately, guys, I've lost again. Kind of becoming routine at this point. I don't like how it's normalized like that, but... Hopefully, we can just win the next time, you know? There's always the next time. See you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.